Thank you. It wasn't all bad news today in the pandemic. Big news came from the FDA as it authorized Pfizer's Paxlovid medication. It's an antiviral pill doctors are calling a game changer for those suffering from COVID-19. CBS 4's Bo Beth Yates is live in Aventura tonight with more details on the new treatment. Bo Beth? Well, Lauren, the last time we spoke, the line here at Aventura was just about two hours long. Now it has gotten down to just about 20 minutes and they'll be open till about midnight. But those we spoke to here say they are happy that there is news that pretty soon they may no longer have to join lines like this. Merry Christmas. This is absolutely a game changer. Dr. Gita Nair was all smiles talking about the latest weapon in the fight against the coronavirus. So just like Tamiflu for the flu, this gives us the option that even if you get infected, this could prevent you from ending up in the hospital or a severe infection. So this is Pfizer's new antiviral pill called Plaxovid. It's the first pill to treat COVID-19. The FDA granted its emergency authorization and it will be made available to high-risk adults and children who've contracted the virus. It stops a variety of enzymes that the virus needs to replicate. So the whole, the, the whole fanfare about this medication is that we have options. We have treatment options. This means if you get infected with COVID, you can very quickly take one of these medications potentially and be able to have less severe infection. Studies show the COVID pill is about 90% effective in reducing symptoms and preventing hospitalizations. And Miami-Dade County Mayor Daniela Levine Cava says it will also help ease the burden on the hospital system. And the antiviral pill can play a key role in preventing our hospitals from getting overwhelmed, which we all know is a key factor in keeping our community safe. Another key benefit is that those with a prescription will be able to self-treat at home, similar to a Z-Pack. Daniela Levine Cava says they're already taking steps to get the pill in South Florida. Just yesterday, we learned that the pill may be approved as soon as this week. So we are doing everything possible to ensure that we're ready to make it available right here at our testing sites. Now, there is a COVID task force created by the federal government, and they tell us that they are working with many of these pharmaceutical companies. And one of the things that they are trying to do is make sure that as soon as the pharmaceutical companies make those pills available, that they are shipped out to many of the communities like ours that need them. Live in Aventura, Bobeth Yates, CBS 4 News, tonight.